Okay, this is the Coachman Adrenaline. Um, it has the solar panel on the roof that someone has put up there, I believe. And it's going to do a walk around. There's also a toolbox which has been added as well, which uh, is currently empty, so that's storage. It does come with room to put a generator if you wanted to and the generator would go in here. Okay, this is inside the area where you can put a generator. I believe that is for the solar on the roof. I think and this is also where your coach battery goes. Okay, tires have very good tread. They look pretty much brand new. They definitely are brand new from what I can tell. The area here where you can add some gasoline for the um, generator. Okay, this is the rear. Side view from the back. This is the side here. The body looks um, very straight. There's no issues with delamination or anything like that from what I can see power awning outside speaker system we do have this little thing here where someone is kind of taped over it it's missing the little cover like a little storage compartment door right here at the front has manual jacks these are the specs here VIN number and weight etc is from outside. Looks like there was something here originally. I'm not sure what that is exactly. You've got your tie downs on the floor. Kitchen. And you've got your beds that lower down. It's the top bed up there. And this is like couches that can be converted also to a bed. TV. Cupboards stereo system We've got some kind of little vent there um, this is some lights and new vents on the roof there's a lot of those up there okay and you've got a window on each side right there looks like a little of um, moisture is getting in there on the edge of the window. It's pretty normal to have little things like that happen. Sort of make sure that that gets sealed at some point. Okay, comes with a ladder. Okay, this is your sink right here. The little stove top does have that little thing there that does need to be fixed up so that will just need to be put back into place okay you've got your refrigerator and freezer this is the bedroom right here with some storage drawers underneath okay and the window also little storage cupboard in here and vent on the roof AC got some little kind of connectors over there electric connectors and storage shelf your AC controller and it looks like maybe a light or something we don't have this hooked up at the moment um, this is the bathroom here and toilet shower it's not a bad size and got a little bit of kind of stuff just up there on the on that little strip where it looks like some moisture damage there on that sink floor shower we'll need a little wipe down thing it's like a something there for the toilet paper I guess that they have wrapped around that door so it's like interior lights and things this is your awning um, 
We don't have the um, battery connected, so we can't actually get that awning out. But it looks to be pretty clean and tidy from what I can tell. They normally need a little wash once they're fully opened. Um, this is pretty much it. Um, floor seems pretty solid from what I can tell. Um, it's just a little dusty, but this floor is solid all the way around. Could do with a little wipe down. Um, but this is pretty much it. So roof looks pretty good. I would say it probably just needs like a good clean. There's just a few little cosmetic things here and there as well. Um, so yeah, and then of course that strip on this corner here I noticed right there. The little strip is kind of coming off and that looks like, um, I guess over time, you've probably had a little bit of moisture get in there as well. Um, main thing is with any camper is just make sure that everything is sealed and windows and things like that. You want to go over them every year, make sure that they are solid and uh you know you don't get any further leaks coming in so anyway hope that helps i mean i hope you have any questions at all